Before you judge them, walk a mile in their shoes. How often have you heard that expression? Or more importantly, when was the last time you reflected on that statement and last time you actually paused and try to better understand your colleagues, your neighbors, your fellow humankind with the challenges and difficulties that they may be facing at the moment. And maybe some of them that are completely understandable, yet there might be something you and I know nothing about. In today's world, in today's environment, it's very easy. It's actually in many instances sadly encouraged to be divisive to be us versus them, you versus me, he versus she, and so on. People are being separated and divided across all kinds of vertical and horizontal um, lines, if you will. But when was the last time you looked to the person, to a person to your left or to your right and said, is there something that I can do to be of help to them on this journey? Is there something else that I should be aware of and learn about to better understand the challenges that they're facing? I thought about this recently, and one of many examples that came to me, and those who really know me well know exactly this story and what I'm talking about, but um, some dozen years ago, maybe longer, maybe 15, um, a number of major strategic decisions were made by a number of executive leaders, one in particular, who many of us who were several levels, levels lower did not understand and did not agree with. Fast forward a decade later or more, I still may not agree with everything they did. I still may not understand every move they made, but I have a better understanding and a better appreciation for why they did it. Because at that point in time, they had access to information that I did not. They had other strategic goals and objectives that were coming down the road, maybe six or 12 or 18 months from that day that I didn't know about. Or they were being pressured by market, competition, their teams, their peers, their bosses, board of directors, all of which I knew nothing about. So the older you get and the more at peace you are with yourself, with who you are, number one, and number two, who you're becoming, the easier this gets. It's very easy to pass blame and judgment and point fingers at somebody else. We should start with ourselves every single day and really walk a mile in somebody else's shoes before we even contemplate of judging them or accusing them of anything you and I may know nothing about. So think about this next time you're in a face, you're facing a challenging decision, or you are asked to support or move forward with an initiative at work that you may not agree with entirely. Try to understand, seek to listen, seek to understand, share your thoughts, ideas, and perspectives at all times. By all means, I have my whole life weren't always well received, but it's important to be who you are at the end of the day, right? Everyone else is already taken. So you got to be true to yourself as you move forward. But think about that aspect of walking a mile in their shoes and really trying to understand them. Now, I'm not saying we justify every decision. I am not saying we ignore criminal or, or other kind of inappropriate behavior. Absolutely not. People need to be held accountable for their actions and decisions. 100%. I believe in that. I believe in merit. I believe in work ethic. I believe that you get out of it when you put in. But let's try to give people a little bit more grace, a little bit more understanding as they make decisions, as they move forward, and as they ask you to join them along on that journey. Have a better understanding of where people are, their reference point, and try to help them understand how you feel and what your needs and priorities are as well. So they can all kind of commingle and move forward together as opposed to it's always X versus Y, blue versus red, and so on. I think we can do better collectively as a humanity, as a society, in every single organization, every single neighborhood, 
if we started with understanding that that's a fellow human being next to you or across from you who is trying to do good things for that community or that organization. And let's truly hear them out and understand what those objectives are and how can we be a supporter or an ally or a partner in that journey. And if there are things you absolutely disagree with, you should always look for opportunities to share those thoughts as well. As always, if this is the first video you have watched, please consider subscribing below, sharing it with your friends and colleagues, and most importantly, leave your thoughts and ideas in the comments below. As always, have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best. And may today be a lot better than was yesterday or last week or last month because you're intentional about your life and you're taking steps that you know you need to take so that a year from now, you're that closer, that much closer to your goals and hopes. So have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best.